How do you do? Graham Murphy here, Category Manager at Tech Rentals. Just going to have a quick look at the Omicron CT Analyzer. Now, we uh, supplied in the kit um, various cables, etc. Um, and we're just going to run this is a CT which is in the kit. So I will we'll just run uh, and test this CT. Now, we need to wire the instrument up according to the diagram on the front here. So we've got the primary side and the secondary side. Right, I need to wire the output of the CT, this red and white wire here, red and black wire here. So I'm going to bring those two down here, in here, and either side of the secondary side of this CT. So I'll connect um, this to here to there. Now we've got a little earth line which is down here, which we'll connect that up in a second. So we've got that there, and I'll connect the other side of this. Here's my secondary, to my secondary down here. Now, what I've done here is the fact that what we've got to do is connect the earth up to this black side, so I'm going to, there's the black on the black side here, so I'll connect that up to my earth there. Now, I need to connect the primary side, so I'll grab a wire Now, there's no actual terminal here, we just need to run the wire through this gap, so I'm going to run that through there and connect these two together so that's effectively that's the primary side of the transformer and connect the other side up here so we've got it wired according to this diagram switch is on the other side over here okay we've got everything wired up um, we've got the wire, the main, this main wire running through here, the CT. We've got all the details on the front here, uh, the specs on that CT. So I switch this instrument on, and switch over the side here. Right, now what we need to do, I go to main menu, I want to do a new CT test. One, two, up there, and I go OK. Now, I can come down, I can enter a location, I can enter all sorts of details. When we go enter on that, I hit these buttons once, but notice that's lower case, so I'm going to go back, hold this shift key down and hit that, T. Now I'll hold the shift key down and hit R, R, etc. So we're happy with that. Um, other details you'd normally enter, so I'll hit back. In this case, I have, I'm not bothering. So we come down to this field. This is the primary current. Now, according to this spec here, this device is 300 amps on the primary and five amps on the secondary. So we enter 300 here, enter, arrow key across, five here, enter, arrow key. Now it's 50 Hertz, which it says on the front display here, which is great. Now I come across this is, uh, um, we're just going to call it a, a CT, a just standard metering CT. Now, the class is 0.5. There we go. Now, once we're happy with all those results, the, these figures we've hit here, this is the test button. So I'll hit start the test. It's doing a calibrate. Ah. Tested okay. Now, we're happy with that. We can, when we hit click on this to save the result, it's saved to the flashcard here, which you can consequently read. Um, I'll just go, uh, we hit click on save if we want to. Now we can also look at the results up here. If we come across there, the test results, secondary wiring resistance, knee point, um, C2 ratio 300 to 5.0175. So it's 
correct and various other readings we can actually see the excitation graph so it's easy to see the, the knee point there. Um, very simple now we can add any other comments etc and when you've done all this stuff at any stage you can hit click on the save button it's saved to a flash memory card so you've got your report you've entered all the appropriate correct details in here very easy instrument to use highly accurate great for doing um, custody transfer uh, quality devices etc thank you very much